how to do the settings of uh, face ferry relay this is the one of the face ferry relay for Snyder uh, see like this here line 1 and line 2 and line 3 so in here we are we are given to supply for three phase supply R Y B any of the terms because of these are the three terminal three terminals having a three phase supply we are going to give a three phase supply this three phase supply going to compare in the inside for symmetrically coming or not then here the according to the three phase supply here the relays are switched on the three phase supply is coming for correctly or not then only the a relay switches are switched on this is for function then how to we are doing the settings of this relay just see here uh, the voltage ranges will be available in here 220 380 420 420 like this then the another one up is having a uh, over voltage that means the over voltage percentages are available in here up to 20 percentage uh, to we change in here then another one thing we have available for under voltage knob this under voltage knob also we are going to change up to 20 percentage uh, 2 percentage to up to 20 percentage we are going to change in here then symmetrical knob the symmetrical knob is a very important to uh, adjustment because of this a uh, symmetrical knob will going to compare the three voltages like this R and Y and B the three voltages are the symmetrical knob going to adjust and adjust to and compare to switch on the relays then the fourth knob is timing uh, how much time to switch it on like this this is only having a only for 10 seconds 0 0.1 to 10 up to 10 seconds in here having in here this is for basic one phase failure relay so the same similar to another phase failure relays also available in market uh, just uh, i am explained for schneider that's all if you have any doubts please come on here thank you hi guys now we are going to see uvr under voltage relay the uvr having a three terminals like this a1 a2 and a3 this is the t three terminals we are giving a three phase supply and the another one terminal also having uh, neutral the four terminals we are going to giving a three phase supply and neutral also so in the under voltage regulator is compared that these are the three voltage and neutral also then the three voltage and neutral also coming for correctly that means our line to line voltage is 440 and line to neutral voltage is 240 this is the correct then this is going to switch on the output relays that means the common supply is going to connect N NO and the NC going to N NO that's the thing doing in here then another one up is available in here for timing that means the one second through three hours up to three hours we are going to change the timing the knob is available this is not for sober like this see here this is also not see here this is for adjusting knob there's a different kind of UVRs are available in here our market that's all guys thank you guys now we are going to see difference between uh, phase failure relay and UVR phase failure relay versus under voltage relay how do we are going to differentiate in those other uh, two terms in the two two things are having a common terminals are one two three like line one and line two and line three in phase failure relay also having a line one and line two line three and under voltage relay also having a line one and line, line two and line three and neutral also these are two relay also having a like this then next this two relay also having a some relay points like this 
common n c and n group this is for the when the 3 volt 3 voltage or neutral is available for perfectly the reference compared to reference voltage that the time the relay will be activated and the get we got uh, some control for control work on in this side so this is a work for uvr and phase value relay so how they are differentiated from the voltage comparison suppose you have a under voltage relay we are giving a three phase supply on here and neutral also at the time the UVR is sensing the three phase voltage is coming for line to line 440 voltage and line to neutral 240 220 something like this these are the voltages available available then the under voltage relay will be activated but in here we do some illegal things like this we have a only single phase supply we are going to switch on some cases for under voltage relay we are giving phase on line 1 and neutral on line 2 then take the looping off like this so in this case what what did this under voltage relay this case also the under voltage relay activated because of this relay need for 440 voltage for two lines so like this in this time the phase failure relay is not activated why because of phase failure relay need for phase shifting comparison because of the phase failure relay having a phase shifting comparison that means line 1 and line 2 and then line 3 like this the phase fair relay need for phase shifting of 120 degree like this line 1 and line 2 and line 3 phase shifting voltage 120 degree electrically shifting needed then only the phase fair relay activated for output relay terminals then we are doing a control terms of control terms on an output side that's all guys if you have any doubts please comment here thank you for watching